With all the beer that Gio Martinos sell at their 10 CNY restaurants, sometimes a bartender will say, this one's on me, or give too much change, or spill some. Thousands, yeah, tens of thousands of dollars a year. Tens of thousands. Losses are huge, or at least used to be. Now that U.S. BeverageNet's monitoring software is installed on tap lines at Tully's and Copper Top Tavern, it allows us to find errors immediately. Because the tap monitors are synced to the register, so when beer flows, money had better pour in. Then the info streams to a secured website so bars can run a tab of its inventory. About seven or eight percent of all of our draft beer that was poured was wasted. And now we're down to about one or two percent. Not only has the product changed the bottom line of restaurants in 11 states, it's also changed what beers those restaurants are selling. We're actually finding that customers are expanding their draft beer offerings as well as going into premium, premium products where they can realize a higher margin. Young, a former beer distributor, says he originally wanted to monitor his own inventories, but saw an opening in the restaurant business. We expect that to grow in the next uh, 6 to 12 months by at least 50%. Uh, Growth that could mean the end of free beer, something bar owners can drink to. In Syracuse, Evan Axelbank, News 10 Now.